Hi everyone, I'm really excited to share something with you today. My custom subtitle pack for DaVinci Resolve. A lot of you have asked for it and I thought why not make it available for you so you can use it in your own projects. So here it is. After getting it from my coffee page link in the description, you will end up with a file looking like this, which you want to double click and open in order to launch DaVinci Resolve and then click on install. Once you install it, you want to click on the effects library, expand the toolbox, titles, then you will see MG subtitle and then you're gonna grab it and leave it over your main footage and from there on it's even easier you can highlight it go to the inspector and there's a few things you can adjust i left in there the most major things that you can want to adjust in the subtitles such as the color for example you can rewrite the text obviously if you want to use this subtitle you have to be able to customize even the text you can adjust the amount of speed that you want to add next to the camera shake motion on that sub effect you can slower and increase also the overall strength movement of that shaking of that subtitle now it's looking slower you can also add some randomness by increasing the values up there in order to make it random motions also the rotation deviation the xy deviation and other stuff as well like i said i just kept the most major things that you want to change in there also i forgot to mention the top one gain this is about the shine because it's having a glow you can decrease it to zero if you want to remove the gain or increase it if you want even more and at the very bottom you can change the font and also the style of it i recommend using Montserrat which is the one that I'm currently using. Also in the settings, you can change the position of the text and also increase and decrease the size. In order to use it, you can take it down in length, just like this, duplicates of that subtitle by holding out and dragging it to the right side. And then after that, you want to click on them and just type the text that you wish to add. And at the end, you will see something looking like this. For example, let's see this one. I will move them aside so you can see all of the motions. Let's play it. Hey everyone, welcome back. Also from the same coffee page that you can get this one, you can also create a grid background that I have recently uploaded and it's completely free. You can use it as a background for your these subtitles. You can grab it and leave it just under your subtitles and then play it through. There are five different varieties of colors for a grid background. Make sure to visit the link in the description if you want to get access of them. Thanks for watching, I hope it was helpful and see you in the next video.